Jefferson, everybody. We are here to scout out this beautiful spot for the upcoming Oregon Eclipse. And holy damn cow, this is a really, really beautiful sight. So we're gonna set up time right here. We got Mount Jefferson over here. Yet the solar eclipse is gonna happen like in this region. Completely 180. So we really want to get like part of that mountain, maybe in the side, side-ish. That means we have to like go behind the mountain that direction. So we're just gonna kind of explore the roads around here. So it's around 10 o'clock, this is about the lighting that we're gonna get at the solar eclipse. The sun's back here, this is where the eclipse is gonna happen. The moon's shadow is gonna be coming from this direction over at Mount Jefferson. And then over here we have Mount Hood, but Mount Hood's not gonna be in the eclipse, it's only gonna have a partial eclipse. So like, if you imagine just over here and then like there is the center of the eclipse, only just a small band of area across the United States. So I think this is the best spot because we get this huge, open plains down here and then we can get up high on these ridge here. So we're here at Mount Jefferson in Central Oregon uh, practicing for the eclipse. See here we have the solar filter so that we can shoot right at the sun. We've made it to our primary location, but our main goal is to get up to the top here, Alali Butte. So between Mount Jefferson here and Alali is like the center of the eclipse, like the totality, like center path. So we're really close. We get about two minutes. It's about the best you can get in this area. But we looked at the forecast and Oregon and Idaho are gonna be completely clear. We're just playing the waiting game. Time for some sausage. So it's Sunday morning, we're at Horseshoe Lake, but we're gonna go back down the trail over to Alali Lake, park in our spot, and hang out for a little bit this morning. We're we'll getting a boat, and then we're gonna hike up to the Butte and uh, find our spot for the eclipse tomorrow morning. Situation, so we got a little situation here. Oh my god. Nice, okay, you can see it. There's the butte right behind us. That's where we're going. We're in the middle of a lolly lake right now. And now we're gonna hike up to the butte. Boom, we're on the trail going to the top of the Olaley Butte. Ooh, we are fully packed. We are fully loaded. We've got our camera gear. We've got our sleeping gear, warm clothes. And it looks like there's gonna be a good amount of people up there too to share this experience with. Awesome. So the day has finally come. Finally hiking up to the butte. 360 views of the eclipse tomorrow morning. Feels great to be out doing another backpacking trip overnight. We 
just hiked up four miles, 2,500 <laughs> feet, I believe, in, el in elevation gain. Made it to the top. We're up here on the Butte now. It's beautiful. Um, 360 view of all the mountains and everything, pretty much in the surrounding area. We're between Mount Hood here and Mount Jefferson. It's here to the south. We're at the highest point between these two mountains. You can see like every mountain. You can see Hood, and then behind that, you can see Mount Rainier, and then to the left, you can see Mount St. Helens, and then back behind it, over the little ridge there, you can see Mount Adam. We're right in the line of the Cascade Mountains right now. Context 906. I got the shot set up here. It looks like it's drifting down a bit. As you can see, it's drifted to the bottom of the frame. It started up here. I wanted to just go across. The time's finally come. We got first contact on the eclipse. That was crazy. Holy stay, shit. Stay tuned for next eclipse. That was way too quick. Way too quick. It's pretty crazy. Nice solar eclipse. Beautiful day here in August. Wow. Amazing. I don't think I'll ever forget that.